find Benjamin Beaker, and this is Seat Flying TV. Science is sweet. Did you know hurricanes? Did you know that hurricanes are the world's largest storms? They can last days and have winds between 100 to 300 kilometers per hour. That's way too windy for kite flying. Sorry. Talk about a big storm. It can be as big as a thousand kilometers large. And this storm moves too. It travels across land and water. It's a little bit tricky to tell which way it will go. Kind of like my little brother, Bobby Beaker. So how do hurricanes form? When water in the ocean reaches 27 degrees Celsius, or 80 degrees Fahrenheit, enough water evaporates to make large storm clouds. Along with a little bit of a specific type of wind, we have the ingredients for a hurricane. This is why hurricanes happen in late summer to early fall, because it takes a long time for large bodies of water like oceans to heat up that much. Hey Benjamin, which is stronger, a hurricane, a typhoon, or a cyclone, you ask? That's a trick question. They are all the same thing. We just call the storm by different names depending on where you live. Scientists love to organize things. Hurricanes are no exception. All hurricanes are given names from the beginning of the season to the end. They are all in alphabetical order. They also place these storms in their categories from category 1 to category 5 based on how strong and damaging the storms are. A storm with winds over 155 miles per hour is a category 5 storm. These storms aren't too common, but when they appear, they're very, very dangerous. So now you know, smarty pants. Thanks for watching Sweet Science TV. Science is sweet.